volunteers who will serve the first in the Queen's Lancashire Regiment. Drive a grab lorry, you know, I work on the roads laying cables and the utility company. I work on a gas board or do out the gas mains on a link, leaking, leaking mains and that in the road. I build petrol stations yeah. all over the country. Gym, you, you like this gym then do you? What, what, oh, why yeah. did you come here? What do you like about it? Because oh, I'll go to da uh, gyms like David Lloyd and Port Solent and oh, I go in and oh, I don't know, it's like a, it's like a factory or something, it's, it's too big. You know? And um, then you go to other gyms, I mean, you go to, you go to smaller gyms or training garages, that's for you don't want to train in a, in a dungeon, do it. But this place is just right. And it's orientated around everything. Oh, look, you know, you've got Arnold Schwarzenegger on the wall and all that. And it's an industrial sort of gym, you know what I mean? You come in and you feel that you're here to do something, don't you? Mm. So, yeah, this gym is definitely, you know, it goes back a long way and there's all the old stories. There's just a lot more to it than the normal gyms you go to, you know. You don't have to have all the proper clothes. You can come in here straight from work if you've got a bit of mud on you or whatever. It's just got the equipment that we like. We're not in, I mean, our, our like, the cardio work we do most of it be over the end of a shovel <laughs> digging holes and whatever but so we come here just to lift the weights well it's a spit and sawdust place all the lads down here you can walk straight from work come in there's no women in the gym which helps <laughs> yes. all you do is look at the training You're with women in the gym it's a distraction but for some of us isn't it What influence would you say your dad's had on you doing it then? You said earlier that he sort of tried to get you down here. Yeah, I mean, obviously I can't say he hasn't had an influence, he has a good influence, but in my young, like, when I was younger, when I went interested in it, I suppose I sort of took it for granted. But then when I got into it in my own pace, obviously he's been one of the best influences I've had because I can go home and I can, you know, when, we're, when I go around his place, we just talk about it and, uh, and we talk about the gym. Obviously the best, you know, one of the best influences he had is that he trains down here as well and I'll come down here and obviously everyone knows him so I'll get talking to him and that. Uh, and uh, I mean, this is a, a good degree to why, why I'm so into it is this gym, to be honest. And yeah. But yeah, he is good, good influence here now. Anything I need to know, you know, he's been in it 35 years. Yeah. Old, and um, so, so yeah, he put it, he, he, you know, anything I need to know, he's, he's there to tell me.